the topic that we are going to discuss now is himalayan wolf why are himalayan wolf in news let us understand that himalayan wolf has been assessed for the first time in iucn's red list as vulnerable so this is the first time the himalayan wolf has been assessed under iucn red list and they are assessed as vulnerable in the category they are assessed as vulnerable and then himalayan wolf it's scientific name is canis lupus chanco okay so it is a prominent predator which is found in the himalayas and then it is well adapted to the cold environment and it is found in the alpine steppe and tundra habitats which is about 3900 meters on the tibetan plateau and the himalayas okay so that is where they are found and then they are found in the alpine steppe and tundra habitats okay so these himalayan wolf possess genetic adaptations to cope with the hypoxic conditions in the high altitude habitats so what are hypoxic conditions here hypoxic conditions are oxygen deficient conditions okay so when there is no sufficient oxygen in a particular environment that environment is called as hypoxic environment so these himalayan wolf are adapted to live in such hypoxic environment or conditions that is what we need to know here okay so this is that himalayan wolf so they are actually sympatric with snow leopards in large parts of their range what is sympatric sympatric means they share geographical area with snow leopards that is what sympatric is okay so both wolves i mean the himalayan wolves and snow leopards are apex predators in the high altitudinal habitats with some degree of competition for the prey resources because they are living sympatrically they are having competition for prey resources obviously that will be there okay and then they are also found in tibet nepal and indian himalayas so these indian sorry himalayan wolves are found in tibet nepal and then indian himalayas and they are different from the indian wolf how are they different and distinct from indian wolf that we'll understand in this slide okay so this himalayan wolf feeds on ungulates what are ungulates those animals which have hooves okay for example horse goat they'll be having a particular type of feet right that is called as hoof that horny part of the foot is called as hooves okay such animals are called as ungulates so these himalayan wolves feed on ungulates like tibetan gazelle tibetan argali and blue sheep and they also feed on small mammals like himalayan marmot pika and huli hare and they also feed on livestock such as domestic yak and goat okay so here talking about the locations where it is found in india we know that they are found in tibet nepal and indian himalayas but in india where are they found they are found in ladakh that is the union territory of ladakh and then the spiti valley of himachal pradesh and then uttarakhand and sikkim in all these states you can find himalayas okay that is there next is distinction from the indian wolf actually earlier the himalayan wolf and the indian wolf were considered to be the same species but then only in the year 2018 researchers confirmed that the himalayan wolf or the huli wolf was genetically unique and they are different from the indian wolf okay so these indian wolves also called as common or peninsular wolf is found in the plains and the deccan plateau whereas himalayan wolves are found only in those high altitudinal himalayan ranges okay so this is what we need to know about this indian wolf and then what are all the threats faced by the himalayan wolf okay so the threats like depredation conflict that is man animal conflict also called as depredation conflict habitat modification and encroachment this is one major problem faced by many endangered species that is habitat destruction or habitat transformation or modification and then comes depletion of wild prey population when prey population reduces then the predator population will also reduce okay so that because they are linked through a food chain or food web okay 
so this will be there and then hybridization with dogs this is also a main problem when it comes to himalayan woods they are being hybrid uh, hybridized with dogs next is illegal hunting for fur and body parts including paw tongue head and other parts okay so this is also there which are the threats to himalayan wolf okay so this is what we need to know about himalayan wolves because they have been recently included as vulnerable animals under iucn red list and this category was first time done to himalayan wolves okay so that is why